Say his name. A call for answers and accountability. Please. 31-year-old Keenan Anderson died January 3rd, hours after a struggle with Los Angeles police. They tried to kill me! That's a hey, stop him, take you off. He was tased six times in less than a minute. The mother of his five-year-old son sharing the family's pain. Having to hear Keenan cry out for help the way he did and to watch him be hurt by the very people who are supposed to protect him it's something I will never get over. Get up against the wall real quick. Police stopped Anderson after a hit and run accident. The teacher from Washington, D.C. had been visiting family. Body cam video shows he initially complied but later ran away. Please, please. A group of officers then struggled to restrain him, first using body weight, then tasing him multiple times. Anderson died at a hospital hours later of cardiac arrest. It's unclear what role the physical struggle with the officers and the use of the taser played in his unfortunate death. According to the department's toxicology report, Anderson had cocaine and marijuana in his system. Stop it. Yes. Yes. Anderson was the cousin of Patrice Cullors, a Black Lives Matter co-founder. The city now has 45 days to respond to the $50 million wrongful death claim. Donya Backus, CBS News, Los Angeles.